Hi guys and welcome back to our channel. Do you like trading? Do you like cryptocurrency? Then you will like this video because we will be talking about Binance and not only Binance, Binance futures trading. Of course, you can turn 100 bucks to 5,000, 10,000, 20,000 USD only future trading but of course you will need to have some precautions and you will need to be a bit smart with your market analysis we will go through that in binance future trading in the next few minutes but first of all this is not financial advice this video is only for educational purposes and let's get into it So guys, here we are on the Binance platform. I don't need to talk much about Binance. Of course, you know what's going on here. Here we have everything crypto related. You can buy, you can sell, you can stake, you can trade, you can do whatever you want in the cryptocurrency space with relative ease here on Binance. It's not complicated. It has a very friendly feeling to it and everyone trusts and knows Binance. But here we're talking specifically about the derivatives. We're talking about Binance futures. What's going on here in the futures and what kind of options do you have in trading futures well first of all you can trade the perpetual swap against usd or usdt usd uh, tether or equivalent for the usd dollar and you can also have it cryptocurrency versus cryptocurrency so that's all uh, your decision you can have it here coin coin or you can have it here coin usdt so let's go and trade usdt or see what's going on here in trading usdt or perpetual swap between cryptocurrency and usdt of course here the most famous one bitcoin Bitcoin USDT here we have BUSDT Binance USD or you have USDT the normal tether so let's choose that and see what's going on here and how to maneuver your way around simply speaking futures trading meaning that you can bet a certain amount of money and you can leverage this amount of money up up to 100% or so and you can get leverage cross leverage or isolated leverage me personally I do believe and I do support the idea that isolated leverage is more secure and it's more flexible for you as a trader or as an investor rather than just cross cross can wipe up your account and here isolated will be more in a risk management kind of atmosphere and you can rest assured that at least you're only trading with the amount of money you allocate for such a position so as you can see here you can have up to 125 x leverage on Bitcoin of course here they have the warning for you once you exceed a certain amount they will be uh, kind of alerting you that you're getting slightly excited here about the market and you can get of course depending on your risk management strategy up to 125x i never ever recommend you to do that i do believe that you can have maximum probably 10 11 15 or so x which is highly risky but i would say if the market is screaming at you okay that's a good position that's a good opportunity you can even stretch it to 20 or so but that's again depending on your personal preferences or in your own personal analysis of the market and whether you're an experienced trader or not let me say that this requires some knowledge of the market and you will get to know some indicators so what are indicators in general generally speaking here you can have the chart in front of you over there and you can see what kind of time frame you want to deal with first of all you can have the 15 minutes time frame you can have the one hour four hours daily for a long kind of more accurate time frame that's the daily or the weekly or even the monthly so you can adjust all of that and you can also add technical indicators what are the indicators well first of all you have the EMA that's exponential moving average you can have have the RSI you can have some Fibonacci retracement I mean you can have the lot here I personally do sometimes use other platforms for analyzing the market or getting some market analysis but generally speaking here you can have everything in one place I personally like the EMA exponential moving averages I put the 50 EMA and the 200 EMA to give me kind of a general idea where is the market going and once they cross towards the downside that means a bearish move once they cross towards the upside that means that we're having some pump towards the upside and you can somehow predict how the market is moving or how the market is going to go once you get the hang of these exponential moving averages of course you have Fibonacci retracement levels of course you have some more complex systems like the MACD indicator or here you have the volume generally speaking you need to have some knowledge of trading and you need to invest more time in getting to the knowledge of how to read the chart on the market but once you see a good opportunity in the market you can have enough confidence to jump in with a good position and start going so how to go and what's buying short and what's buying long buying long generally speaking means that you can bet on the price going long or going more bullish or going higher than the price of your entry let's say now as we speak the price is at 20,186 meaning that if you click buy long 
meaning that you're betting that the price will continue to go up and once the price starts going up you will start making profit if the price drops that means that you're losing and vice versa that would be the complete opposite if you sell short selling short meaning that you're betting that the price is continue dumping hopefully it doesn't with bitcoin at the moment but in some certain scenarios it will and the market analysis or the chart will scream at you okay that's a bearish flag or that's a bearish move and we can have more dumps in the price so you can short it and then you will make money once the price is going down so many people have this kind of misconception that every single time they can make profit only by the price going up no it's absolutely not it's not depending on the price going up it can also be made some profit some good profits can be made once the price is going down but once you have the good and smart decision to enter the market at a good price with a good leverage before you get too excited about this whole concept you will need also to adapt yourself in managing your risk here you can have certain tools to manage your risk first of all you will need to get acquainted with the chart over here that's a daily chart of course we have been going in a downward movement or a bearish movement for quite some time so let's go to the four hours chart and talk more about what to expect for instance in the next few hours or so as you can see we've been dumping 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 and we're going now in a consolidation phase probably probably if we get over this EMA or get over this violet line over here we can potentially pump it towards upside slightly but generally speaking the market is not showing enough strength to give you confidence that we're going bullish so I would say we can rather go towards the downside slightly before we can have a bounce back so before you get all in in one trade you will have to put some risk management first one is you get yourself isolated in an isolated position or cross that's your own preference but I would say the more safer one is isolated and you can get 14x or 10x or 3x or 2x or even 1x I mean it's up to you it's completely up to you 1x meaning that you can have 100% mirroring of the price without any leverage but you can get a bit freaky and you can increase your leverage and here you can have this toggle over here you can toggle on all the way to 100% of your money or your wallet or your trading wallet you can get uh, or risk eight percent of your wallet ten percent twelve percent up to hundred percent my personal preference as well if you're a daily trader if you trade daily then you can allocate probably between three and five percent or so if your major risk taker probably ten percent not more than that because if you screw up in one point then you might probably have endure a massive hit or a massive loss so some people go all in 100% but that means that you're flipping a coin whether it will be a successful trade or an unsuccessful trade so that's completely up to you but I do believe that you have to put some risk management in place of course you can also have some take profit and stop loss you can click it here and it will show you take profit and stop loss at which price point and then you can also adjust that depending on your market analysis you for instance you're seeing that the price will go up all the way probably to 24k and exactly at 24k you want to take some profit so you don't have to sit on your computer until the price hits 24k or well, you can just simply put here at the take profit 24k and it will execute it automatically for you and the same goes as well for stop loss for instance if you're just getting your risk management in place here and you're saying okay if my analysis is correct we're good 24k but if it's wrong for any reason I can stop my losses at for instance 19k or so so everything is automated here so you don't have to worry about that the good thing is that you don't have to trade only Bitcoin you have a lot of options over here to trade from here the perpetual swap you can have multiple multiple coins to choose from literally or almost I would say almost every coin in the market you can think of you can find it here on Binance and that's why Binance is one of the biggest if not the biggest cryptocurrency space platform on the planet right now as we speak I mean it's just insane to think about how many cryptocurrencies are out there and how many options do you have to trade from so of course many people are just trading Bitcoin some people trade Ethereum some people trade XRP some people trade Luna even uh, some of them are here some of them are just not available I mean you will need to get through uh, some market research here before you get involved in any coin I mean there are a lot of scams out there there are some coins that are moving in a very volatile fashion you have to choose especially if you're a beginner you have to choose a more mild or a more uh, controllable kind of asset I know that Bitcoin is highly volatile but compared to some years ago Bitcoin has been tamed down slightly here so you can rely on Bitcoin you can 
dollar line on ethereum or other well-known coins to trade it here as a perpetual swap against the usdt the other option is trading cryptocurrency to cryptocurrency and as i told you it will be settled in cryptocurrency perpetual swap these contracts will be settled in cryptocurrency so you have to get to more knowledge of what you're doing and get to know more of what you want to prefer here in terms of getting involved in any trade but generally speaking things are very simple things are very very uh, kind of intuitive and the market is just open for anyone 24 7 to trade from so can you trade with small amount of money and get it all the way to crazy numbers absolutely yeah many people you probably saw that on many youtube channels or many youtube influencers are turning small amount of money into a major major profit it happens but i have to give you a warning it's not for everyone and it doesn't happen all the time even for experienced traders so you have to adjust your expectations slightly and you need to maneuver your way around the market with good sense of risk management i mean yeah theoretically you can turn 100 bucks with 125x leverage if you're entering a successful trade and the price doesn't move anywhere in the wrong direction then you can go all the way crazy towards upside you can easily in one day multiply that by 100 or 200 even you can do that but the price had i mean you have to be meticulously calculating your next moves and that's not really an easy task you have to gain some knowledge and you need to get deeper and deeper into trading and know what you're doing and also know that everything involves some risk and you will be risking every single time you're getting in a trade but generally speaking you can also maneuver your way around the market with relative ease once you put some risk management in place and that's why i would highly recommend you to check the links down below and get yourself involved with small amount of money and then once you gain some experience and once you gain confidence in the market you can also push yourself even further in trading so that's the trading part here on binance i would highly recommend you to check it out i would highly recommend you to try it out even not with a big amount of money i'm sure that everyone knows binance everyone is talking about binance everyone is mentioning binance in some way or another but i would say it's your opportunity now to get involved the market is in a biggest correction in a, in a very long time and probably we can have a little dip before we have a solid support over here and then we can bounce all the way towards the upside and then you can have some really good profits with bitcoin if you're not really feeling it like bitcoin you can go to ethereum ethereum is merging or ethereum is transforming from proof of work to proof of stake and this will also cause the price to have some volatile movements so you can snatch some good opportunities here with ethereum as well but again it's at your own risk and you have to gain some knowledge you have to educate yourself it's always good to know more it's always good to open and widen your horizon in what's going on in the cryptocurrency space crypto is here to stay crypto is the future and i would say that the market is about to have a big move and either way whether it's going up whether it's going down you can always make profit once you read the chart correctly and once you know what you're doing you can always make some really good profits so guys in a nutshell we talked about binance futures trading of course you know binance of course everyone has come across binance in some way or another but futures trading with binance there is a reason why it's one of the most powerful platforms on the planet right now it's the biggest by far at the moment as we speak so things are adding up here things are kind of explaining themselves why they are so successful they offer you great service they offer you a lot of options to trade from and they offer you some risk management capabilities as well so i would highly recommend you to check the links down below if you're interested in cryptocurrency space in general whether you want to buy whether you want to trade whether you want to trade with leverage whether you want to invest a stake i mean everything related to cryptocurrency you will have it on binance everything is linked down below and as usual if you like this video hit the thumbs up hit the like button and also give us a subscribe and see you next one Bye bye